Grand romantic gestures can be a cute way to show someone how much they really mean to you. Oh, yeah. yeah. Whether it's a flash mob marriage proposal, wow. a love poem written in the sky, oh. or when Brooke's husband hired a barbershop quartet to follow her around for her birthday. <laughs> yeah, that was so cute, bro. That was terrible. <laughs> that was literally my worst nightmare. Was so it cute. was so like Alexis. I had to make eye contact with these men. <laughs> they were singing to me. It was so wow. Yeah. There wasn't enough like of it. them, is what she was saying. <laughs> yeah, she wanted weird. like an octet. Oh yeah. my god. But one of our listeners spent months working on a special grand romantic gift for his girlfriend, Aww. only to have it backfire in the worst possible way. Uh-oh. You're gonna hear Uh-oh. how in a brand new mass speaker coming up. At 710. 710. No? Nobody else? No, Brooks, no. (laughs) You don't know me. A confession I can't take back. I am... The Masked Speaker. Sex and seven eight five nine two says I've been playing in a soccer league with the same group of dads for the yeah. last four years. Wow! Fun. I only know three of their names. Oh my god, that oh. is the worst! And it's too I'm late so to ask this. the rest now. Yeah. Hopefully they have numbers on their jerseys. <laughs> you know, we, what's up, to? We completely yeah. understand, and that's why on this segment we don't ask for your real name because mm-hmm. we know Brooke's probably gonna forget it halfway through yeah. the segment anyway. <laughs> yeah. Instead, that's right, Jake. We just Wait, let you really? stay completely uh, anonymous for every. <laughs> one's sake while you share your secrets and today one of our listeners wants to go by the fake name levi so levi welcome to the show hello thank you all right hey. levi so you won't be insulted if i get your fake name wrong right <laughs> no okay cool all right, all right well the voice good, changer is on you are the mass speaker whenever you're ready let's hear your confession okay so a couple years ago uh Back in college, my girlfriend was studying abroad, and she went to Italy for oh. three months. Okay. Oh, cool. that's fun. That's Please awesome. don't tell me your girlfriend is Amanda Knox. Oh, oh God. no, no. Oh, what the heck? What? <laughs> Why did your mind even go Are you there? okay? Studying what? abroad, Italy, <laughs> confessions. Wow. I mean. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. It's not the case, right? No, but uh, she was super excited. I was really excited for her, and, and before... She left. We watched the movie The Notebook together. Oh, cute. Yeah. Okay. okay. So while she was away, I got this idea and I bought a journal. Oh, God. And every day on one page, I wrote down different things I loved about her. You know, whatever I was thinking, fond memories, you know, yes. any, any happy things. Did she know you were doing this or you were going to surprise her with it later? Yes, the plan was to surprise her with it. And every day I would write something, even though my friends gave me a hard time. They're like, you writing in your love journal again? (laughs) Alexis, you do this with your, like, foreign boyfriends, right? You keep little love journals about them at home? Yeah, different languages? Um, yes. That's what I'm writing. Her love journal's her passport. I'm writing all their great personalities. (laughs) But it is kind of a sweet thing, even though we're joking about it right now. You've put all this thought and effort into a really nice gift for your girlfriend to show you're thinking of her while she's overseas i think that's great mm-hmm. yeah it helped me feel like i was close to her and you know yeah. like, we're still talking and texting but Good. you know when we're not it's like she's there you know and I'm, it's a little okay. side project i was doing the whole time mm-hmm. okay and when did you plan on giving it to her so right when um she was supposed to be back it was going to be her birthday so it was like a one-two punch i was going to give it to her as a gift oh, oh okay. that is nice this all sounds great man i feel, I, like, I this, feel like we're about to be let down i yeah i feel like yeah. this is going to end really poorly yeah. why i think oh. there's going to be a happy ending yeah and the convention College, is they're happily married. study abroad <laughs> this does not add up jeffrey why what happened levi yeah. well what would be a fun memory or a memento to give her kind of got ruined because a week before she's supposed to come back i got a call from her and she said, hey, I'm going to be staying in Italy because uh-huh. she met a guy. Yeah. Oh, gosh. oh, my God. Yeah. People that cheat. Alexis, your boyfriend is doing, <laughs> doing work <laughs> over there. I won. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> she would not care. Oh, my God. Like, Good, oh, I'm doing work I'll here. check on him today. <laughs> dude, I'm sorry. That's terrible. Yeah, I mean, I was wrecked. It was with some Italian dude named Camasso or something. Oh, no. So some time has passed, and the whole time... She was with him. I was yeah. watching Instagram stories. Oh, and, no. oh dude, you're torturing you know, yourself. Riding on their Vespas and 
Oh, wait, this is after Vespa's. you stayed following her, you're saying? Yeah, I mean, she didn't unfollow me, and I didn't unfollow yeah, her. Okay. So yeah, like, yeah. You know. I mean, it is nice to have pictures of the Italian countryside pop yeah. up in your feed every once in a while, you gotta admit. Yeah, he's just saving it in his travel folder. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you know, that's what it some, is. Some yeah. ideas, I'm sure. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's hard, So, man. anyway, one of the times I popped in to check on her Instagram recently... It turns out she's single. Okay. Mm. Oh. So okay. the thing is, I still have that journal, and oh. now I'm like, I don't know if I've lost my feelings for her. And, oh, you know, no. this was something special that maybe if she knew about would have changed how things ended with us. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, that's do I mail it to her and have her see it? No. No. It doesn't feel right. I no. mean, that would be like just like the movie The Notebook. It would be. Because <laughs> Rachel say... McAdams marries somebody else while he's writing yes. letters yeah, to some him. Some people get back together later okay, in life. Okay, listen. I know you love that movie. Yeah. <laughs> I can't stand it. Oh. I think it's terrible. I okay. think that it is not a good reality check for anyone when it comes to love. That's true. It's definitely a movie. I think that <laughs> if he sends this, it is going to come across creepy and desperate. Yeah, he just can't get over it. You're the one that likes reading in this room, bro. Yeah. <laughs> but how are you against no this? I've had exes leave like love letters yeah, and stuff post, and it is true. it's a big ick. Well, it okay. Is. So you're you're actually considering mailing this love journal over to your ex girlfriend in Italy so that she could see it. Yeah, I feel like I want oh. to do that. I'm leaning Why towards sending it. That, bro? Oh my I mean, god! It's better yeah. than you just unexpectedly showing up in Italy. I'll yes. give you yeah. that. Yeah. You know. Yeah, and I wouldn't have to look at it anymore. Okay. Uh, but I am worried about the outcome if I do send it. Hey, what if you yeah. did send it, but you wrote a note like, "Look, this was a long time ago. I don't feel this way, but this is just for me to get this well, off my chest." But that would be a lie. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> it may be cathartic for you to for just him. ship it off, and I think to you somebody just... somebody else. I'm just worried it's going to end up in the trash either way. Yeah. <laughs> no, it, will. it will, for sure. At least it's not yours. <laughs> I, I, she I feel bad. I mean, I do feel for you. That is hard. Yeah, man. So you're, you're, you're still deciding whether or not to send it? Yeah, I'm, I'm unsure, but I feel like if I send it, the worst thing that happens is she says, yeah, I, I left you because I left you, not I left yeah. you because of the situation. Yeah. Uh, and the best thing that happens is she says, oh, wow, I didn't know you were that crazy about me. If I had known to fly to Italy now, let's pick up where we left off. Oh. I mean, you have a point. That's a thought. I mean, I don't know. She could stay in another country for a reason. <laughs> She's still there, right? Stop giving up on okay, love, sorry, Alexis. sorry, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm trying to be hopeful for you. Yeah. Good <laughs> luck, Levi. Yeah, uh, buddy. Truly, brother. Mm-hmm. Yeah, broken hearts hurt, Thank man. Thank you. Man, heal yourself. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. No. He's building oh, her a house by a lake right now. <laughs> Text in 7859. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that was a nice one. Text in 78592. If you have a confession you've been holding on to, we'll hide your identity, mask your voice, and make you the next mass speaker. Your phone tap's coming up next.